What's up guys, welcome to Apex, thanks for tuning in. Finally, after a long wait, the task changer, which is a good lock module, has been enabled on One UI 3.1. Thanks to one of the subscribers, Syed, who gave me a heads up on this particular update. We have been waiting for this for a couple of months already. As we all know, this enables us to change the layout of the recently used applications or tasks. Now, before we go ahead and have a look at this, if you are new here on the channel, and if you love contents on Samsung phones, Galaxy watches and Android applications, you are at the right place. Go ahead and subscribe to the channel and leave a like for this video if you find it useful. Now let's go ahead and take a look at this. Let me open good lock module here. As you can see, when I tap on task changer, it still says congratulations for your new operating system, blah, 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 and it is not functioning. What the developers have done is they have integrated this task changer feature within home up module for good lock. So the update you are going to receive is for home up good lock module. So you have to first update this module and then you will be able to see task changer being integrated into this. I will not be talking much about home up module in this video. If you're interested to know about home up, I did make a video sometime back. In fact, it's a few months ago. Uh, you can go ahead and check the link in the description to watch that video. Now I have already updated home up. Let me just tap on this. Here you can see the task changer sitting right there at the bottom. So this definitely makes sense to have this particular feature in home up module instead of having this feature in a separate module altogether. All right, now let me just tap on the task changer. This is the interface here. As you can see, this is limited to only three types of layout and maybe in the future they will add more layouts to this. We've got list. We have grid, and we have got stack. These are the three layout types we have. And as you scroll down, we have got few other settings here. We have got detail settings. Uh, we can enable center the currently running application when you enable this when you swipe to see the applications the currently running gap will be at the center and we can also enable app label and hide search bar we also have some gesture settings here let me tap on this this shows switch to previous apps with gestures here we have gesture help and uh, it shows how to switch to previous app with gestures. And now by using this feature here with this module, switching to previous app with swipe gesture is much more smoother now. Let's go back. We also have a couple of more toggles here. We can allow bottom gestures in full screen mode, allow gesture in pay region of home screen, which means if you are using Samsung Pay, where you will have a hint area at the bottom for Samsung Pay. So this toggle will allow the gestures even in that area. We also have bottom gesture sensitivity setting here. You can enable this and set the bottom gesture sensitivity. So these are the settings we get with this module. And I'm really glad to receive this update. You guys go ahead and update your home up module on good lock application. Let me know your thoughts about it in the comment section below. That's all I have here for you guys. Thanks a lot for watching you guys. Take care and stay safe. I will see you in the next one. Cheers. Bye-bye.